So I want you to start from uh, background template as always and delete the replace me file and uh, let's skip this. I want you to go on focal distance and focus on uh, your lights here. I want to color this light and give it a red. I want to call it kick. Now we want to go on the background material and uh, turn the shader type into. We need some light stuff here. And as you can see, we're red now, but if we turn this off, on and off, click on actions, animate, blink. There you have it. So just now listen to your track and uh, try, you know, to make a compromise on uh, when your kick hits. I'll make it faster, slower. Got the point, right? Let's keep it one. I want you to duplicate the light here and rename it as snare change the color of the snare yes and you want to do the same for this light blink and you want to give this a different duration a different value and uh, listen to your snare in your track try to put a value to start restart your project and uh, this is really important make sure you click on restart when your kick hits or when your snare it's really important to synchronize your effect to your music so wait for the kick restart add a third light and call it I had you want to give this a different color, do the same, blink and since I'm trying to synchronize it to a trap song, I want the hi-hats to go real fast and crazy, so I'm gonna put at least 0.2, I want that, so yeah, that could work. Press restart. Click on the background and try if you want to see the background a little bit. Go on, add. Turn the opacity down. And go on subtract. It's pretty cool. I think I'm gonna go with this. And uh, that's basically it. Of course you can go even more complex and uh, you should because I think it has great potential so maybe you can make it even cooler let me know so face tracker let's add some more things here let's now add a plane I want you to duplicate it two times kick Snare, hats, create a new material for those, play material, you have to go on advanced render option and uh, click on that. Now what I want you to do is click on these three planes, and do the same, click on visible, sure you put hats next to hats snare next to snare and patch them with the lights we just made they're gonna go on and off for you real quick so 
I want now to... What do I want to do? I want to click on kick and uh, go on actions, animate, and float. Grab this patch. As you can see, one of our plane, the kick plane, is floating. Now I want to do the same for my snare. Change the value inside here. Just change the range, as you know already. Let's go on hats and do the same and uh, change the value here. Separate them a little bit to show you this effect. Let's try and move them a little bit from the face. So you got the point, right? You can also add the delay patch if you want. And uh, have them delayed. And so you don't even need all of this, but you need just one transition. Duplicate the delay or just add the new one and give this a 1, actually it's 0 0.5 and plug the snare here and give it a 1. We kind of get things the same, but see, you know what I mean. Like, if you want to change the uh, shape of the plane, you can go anytime on the plane material and uh, go on alpha material new texture I'm just gonna go with this circle face mesh and I'm gonna be little circles you can of course select them all together make them bigger maybe you want them smaller Let's go 0 0.3, 0 0.3, and 0 0.3. That's basically it. Of course, you can connect a particle system and uh, have it change it in rings. I like it better this way. You can give it the same material material adjust the radius here and the uh, same just click on visible and uh, plug it whatever you want it's gonna go on and off so here it is how you fake sync your music or track to your effect. I'm gonna post a download link in the description as always so you can download and start from here or just follow the tutorial and uh, show me what you make with this. I'm really curious. Let me know if you have tested out different ways to do it and I'll see you soon.